This tiny house is part of the Portland, or, art scene. The tile flooring is an amazing Dutch. You don't notice it right away, but once you do, you realize how much consideration went into this design. This arched roof, cherry red home with the aquamarine trim, known as the caboose, is one of six tiny shelters that together make up the fleet of luxurious tiny houses known collectively as Caravan the Tiny House Hotel. Located in an arts district of Portland, or, this unique hotel rents out these tiny structures as a way to share the experience of tiny house living and spread the word on what life might look like if you jettisoned most of your stuff and focused on an experiential life, instead. If nothing else, the caboose, which comfortably sleeps for, attests to the wellspring of creativity that the tiny house movement has opened up for builders and homeowners. Forget factor built. Taki Taki Housing, these lovingly crafted homes are virtual works of art. Just look at the extraordinary care that went into building this one. A hey, picture is worth 1,000 words. Look at the tongue and groove paneling under the red pillow on the left in the photo below. Notice, too, that the plates, bowls, and even drinking cups match the interior color scheme. That's the door to the bathroom at the far end, by the way. This hotel suite has electric heat hot water, a flush toilet, and a shower, according to the hotel's website. Talk about attention to detail, the tile flooring is an amazing Dutch. You don't notice it right away, but once you do, you realize how much consideration went into this design. This seating nook is delightful. Notice the glossy varnish on the table and the beautiful tongue and groove walls. You can also see, looking right through the window or the front door, that the caboose is not located in some backwoods, mountainous area, as many tiny houses are. This one is in the middle of the Alberta Arts District in Portland, or dot the fishbowl look to the camera shot below makes the arched roof and exposed ceiling beams of the caboose really stand out. Notice the four wall sconces, you can only see three, that give this bedroom balance light after sunset. Curtains, of course are needed for privacy in this downtown setting. And pat yourself on the back for noticing the teeny tiny shelf on the right with the flower and vase. The caboose may be part of a downtown hotel, but guests still get to cook for themselves in this luxurious, little kitchen. The high gloss finish makes for easy cleanups, but also helps make the darker wood of the counter and kitchen trim contrast well with the lighter colored walls. A close-up look at the kitchen. More kudos if you notice the artwork on the hotel's common area outside the window. Across the quad, you can see parts of two more of the six tiny houses that make up this unique downtown hotel.